It looks like your average summer camp, but along with swimming and sports, an important medical study is underway. Campers at Camp Jocelyn have type 1 diabetes, and some are testing a high-tech device that could change their lives. You're a hero? Yeah. Six-year-old Gavin Farmer is one of the youngest campers wearing a bionic pancreas. A bionic pancreas is a device that automatically controls blood sugar, and the way it does it is to sense the blood glucose using a little sensor that just goes underneath the surface of the skin. Tomorrow, Dr. Stephen Russell is leading the study, the first to test the device in children ages 6 to 11. Dr. Ed Damiano helped develop the bionic pancreas. The sensors send information to a smartphone that controls two pumps with hormones. Every five minutes it makes a new decision and it then commands the dosing of insulin and glucagon. Researchers decided to test the bionic pancreas here at camp because children are exposed to a wide range of activities and meals. The bionic pancreas is not yet FDA approved, but parents see its potential. You can pretty much not have to worry about, you know, counting carbs and, and you know, did I give them too much insulin? Did I give them too little? You're wearing the bionic pancreas right now? Yeah. I can't even tell. 11-year-old camper John Briggs and his dad are both diabetic. And this is great because it's just flexibility where he can just go and be a kid and he doesn't have to worry about, you know, if something might happen. Marley Hall, CBS News, Carlton, Massachusetts.